Yo what up guys this is Isaac here and today I'm going to give you a quick good tutorial on colour correction, render settings and velocity so it's a supplement for Twixter. If you know what Twixter is it's basically, uh, sorry if you don't know what Twixter is it's what they use in montages to get super slow motion, it's for Adobe After Effects. If you don't have Adobe After Effects it's a really nice supplement that you can get in Sony Vegas although it is not as good. So what you want to do is drag your clip in after you've imported it and you want to stretch it out as far as it can go so hold control and just click and stretch uh, then you want to right click insert remove envelope and velocity it creates this green line like opacity you can go up to the top which is 300% so that's faster and uh, minus 100% which is slower so it reverses it goes in reverse obviously you want to go to like 17 10% if you want super slow motion um, you know, don't go as low as 3 because at 3 it starts lagging. You could try it on your computer, but for some reason for me it lags really badly when rendered out. After you've done that, you want to add color correction. So you go on to video effects. Just let me click on the clip. You want to go on video effects. Saturation adjust, which is down near the bottom. Click on reset to none. Drag it on your clip. I've got a preset, which is called COD4CC, but up here it won't have anything. Oh, sorry, it will say untitled. Um, so what you want to do is... Uh, if I click on Code 4 cc comes here and you want to pause the video now and copy all these little uh, numbers out. So I hope you've done that by now. After you've done that, you want to come up here and where it says Untitled for you, just copy it, something out, so call it Code 4 cc or whatever. Press the Save button and next time you drop down, it'll be there. So after you've done that, as you can see, it's already made a nice effect. But that's not uh, nearly as good as what we want it. So you want to scroll up and go to Color Correction Secondary. So if I just make this over a bit more, you can see there's Color Corrector and Color Corrector Secondary. Click on Secondary, get Reset to None, drag it down, and like the same, like last time, I've got the same one, Cod4 Color Correction. Copy those settings out, and pause the video now, copy them out, also copy these out. I don't think I've changed much down here, but you might want to just copy them out, uh, just in case. Uh, obviously do the same, call it what you want and save it. After that you want to download a plugin called Magic Bullet Looks. You can get this for Vegas and After Effects but on Vegas it just creates a really nice blurred edge and uh, makes the clip look a lot better. So you want to get default and you want to drag it in, click edit and when it comes up eventually on the right you've got tools, saturation, color contrast, stuff like that. We're not using that. We're going over to looks and you will see it like this you want to go on to music videos and scroll down until you see um, crush blue edge double click it and then down here press ok after you've done that as you can see it makes this really nice effect around the edge if i take all of the uh... what we've done so far off you will see that that's what the clip looked like originally and that is what the clip looks like now so a really nice color correction hope you've enjoyed this part of the video now I'm going to go on to render settings, this is just a really quick thing, uh, I'm going to call it whatever you want, um, after you've done that you want to go down here, go on main concept AVC slash AAC MP4, this will say default template, uh, I've got my own one called HDPVR, go on custom and copy that down now, obviously everything's like what you would expect, 1280 by 720 you know, frame rate 59.94, um, pixel aspect ratio 1.0000, number of reference frames for 14 million maximum, 14 million average as well. Go on project finally and put that to best. And yeah, if you want to pause the video now, just uh, copy them out now. So after you've done that, you want to call it what you want up here and press the save button. And then you've got that for uh, the drop down menu here and it'll be at the bottom. Really nice uh, quick tutorial here. Hope you've enjoyed it guys. My new montage is coming out soon with dubs. Uh, big montage. Going to ho hopefully get it on Hazard Cinema, so that'll be good. Uh, see you later guys, this has been DMG Isaac and I will see you next time.